Hey, what's up, people? Today, um, I'm Romeo Rubio, and today I'm going to be showing you a new tweak from uh, Cydia called uh, Mobile Notifier. Really cool tweak. It's been updated a couple days ago, and um, it works really good. What it does is, uh, let me show you real quick. I just sent a message to myself, and uh, as you guys can see, I get the message over here on the top so that's pretty much it every time you get a notification uh, either from other applications or text notifications they're gonna come like that and if it's a text notification you you can get you're gonna get this after if you tap that uh, you're gonna get this uh, quick reply uh, so you can easily reply to your to the person that you're texting and uh, also you can um, save it for later or this button is for if you want to go to the application they'll they'll take it to the take you to the text message application oh and uh, you can just text from here it doesn't um, support the multimedia message yet because uh, I, I tested it a couple times before and every time I try to send a picture it's not uh, well it doesn't have a uh, thing to send a picture or anything like that and also when you get a text with pictures it's not gonna show it over here you gotta go to the application so that's uh, that's not bad though I mean it's a really good cool tweak um, oh and then um, if you wanna save it for later what you can do is if you want to go back to the messages just double click this and then you're gonna get all your no notifications over here not only uh, for the text you're gonna get it for all their applications as well and the way you get rid of them is by if you tap this twice you'll get a clear out clear all uh, button over here so after you press that everything goes away really cool tweak so in order for the if you have byte sms uh, this is only for the people that has byte sms you what you want to do is you want to go to byte sms real quick and uh, edit and go to the settings app uh, thingy and uh, where it says uh, lock screen or unlock screen mode you want to choose the apple alert version uh, because if you have a so uh, show quick reply, it's not going to work. So uh, you got to press the Apple alert. And do the same thing with the lock screen mode. We have it in uh, show quick reply. Just go to the Apple alert. And, and um, that's the only way that it's going to work. So uh, this tweak works with the lock screen. It works really good. So let me show you real quick. Let me send a text. So... All right, like that, and I'm gonna put it in lock screen mode. And um, <clears throat> as you guys can see, I have it. I, the notification is just it's gonna appear uh, under the clock, and every time you tap that, it's gonna show you the text. Or either if you if it's an application notification, it's gonna appear over here. And um, I don't what I don't like this about this tweak, and it kind of sucks is that. And every time you want to um, tap the message or the notification to go to the application, it's not going to work. It's just showing this is pretty much the lock screen mode is to um, to show you uh, the notification, but that's pretty much it. And I really don't uh, like the notification mode in the lock screen because I have slide away a tweak, and every time I uh, unlock the device. Uh, I get this over here and I can't get rid of it so that's why <laughs> I have it off in the settings um, let me show you what our settings application is oh first let me get rid of it well, how you get rid of it of this is when um, you do SP settings and you respring your device so let me respring my device real quick and I'll be right back and uh, let me show you real quick how the settings so the settings for this tweak uh, are going to be in the settings application in uh, over here 
we get the dash on switcher. This is pretty cool about this tweak that you can enable and disable things. So for the lock screen, the lock screen view, view uh, over here, just uh, I have it off, and um, that's it. Um, so for this tweak, um, you're gonna uh, have to add a source. So you're gonna go, you're gonna have to go to manage, then sources, then edit, and you're gonna add this. Uh, this uh, repo right over here. Uh, let me show you real quick. So uh, just um, do edit, add, and then add that repo. Uh, I have it ready. So uh, after that, just um, go into the repo, and then you'll have the model mobile notifier, and um, it works really good. I. So if you have any questions, any comments, please leave it in the section below. Also, if you uh, want to uh, see more tweaks, more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. And uh, please thumbs up this video if you, if you like it. Um, see you in the next one.